What's up guys, it's Rob from Heroes Avenue. I just got done shooting a video about The Flash. I just uploaded it, I closed my computer. I thought I could go ahead and take a nap before I go out on this Friday. But, as we all know, D23 is going on right now, and they just dropped the first trailer for The Mandalorian. This is a Star Wars spinoff meant for Disney+, Plus, and it's dropping in November. I've been really, really looking forward to this. So far, we've only gotten images. We know Pedro Pascal is going to be uh, The Mandalorian, Pedro Pascal playing uh, the, Re the Viper in Game of Thrones. So I was super excited. Uh, I thought I could take a nap, but, but of course we have to do this trailer reaction together. So let's see what Disney has to bring to the table with The Mandalorian. Because to be honest, I wasn't incredibly excited for this. Not as much as an Obi-Wan Kenobi spinoff. So let's see. Alright. Streaming November 12th. Look at all these Stormtrooper heads. So he's going to be a good guy. Good bounty hunter. I'm seeing that Lucas roll. Okay, it's a cool looking ship. Alright, I love the aesthetic of this so far. Oh, Carl Weathers. Yep, we knew he was going to be in here. New planets, I'm excited. This already looks amazing, guys. Oh, the Death Troopers. We're going to see them back in here again. Wow. Going to be in the trenches. Oh! Bounty hunting is a complicated Sick. profession. Ooh. Ooh! was badass. Oh, we got a the carbonite. Wow. Guys. This looks sick. This looks so good. I'm going to have to watch this trailer a few more times after this, but just off the initial reaction, I'm going to going to clip I'm going to skip through this thing, just check out how it looked. Look at the aesthetic. It looks just like, it looks just, it harkens back to the original trilogy. You, you still get the same color palettes from the original trilogy. Um, and it looks like we're going to see a lot of new planets. We don't get the, we don't get to hear Pedro Pascal speak at all, but I thought that was good. I was glad he didn't take off his helmet in this first trailer. I don't think we need to see any of that yet. It should be focused on him as the Mandalorian. Don't necessarily need to sell his face, but... Look at these practical... Are these practical effects? I don't know if these are practical effects or not. We know Jan John Favreau is like the showrunner for this. Um, you know what he could do with The Lion King and and, 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 all, and uh, The Jungle Book. So this may be very well be digital, but it looks like practical effects from here. Um, oh, I don't really know exactly what it's about, but of course, uh, Pedro Pascal's Mandalorian is going to be... Uh, the uh he's gonna be the good guy of the story kind of an anti-hero i assume i'm really glad we get to see death troopers back in here because in rogue one they didn't really have much to do even though uh uh the the, the marketing made them up to be something more than they actually were so i'm glad to see more of death troopers in here and we get we get the little scene with a standoff it looks like a wild west type of showdown i love it that's awesome this guy uh, i forgot his name but he's always a bad guy in the movies Oh man, this looked awesome, guys. Um, that night sequence looks super dope. Um, but but guys, the best part, um, you get to see Pedro Pascal and his droid uh, partner right here. This this sinister looking robot bounty hunter thing we saw in Empire Strikes Back. Never got to see it in action, but um, now we get to see it in action. And this last bar move that he did, shooting this guy and then pulling him into the door so that the door slams on him. But to make the door like slam shut on him, he had to shoot. That was awesome. That was a totally awesome action sequence. I'm super hyped. Even more hyped now, Disney Plus totally has my money, unfortunately. Damn it, Disney, keep, in t keep taking everybody's money. Disney rules the world, unfortunately. But uh, yeah, I'm totally sold on this. Let me know what you guys think about uh, this Mandalorian tr uh, first trailer. I thought it, I thought it over-exceeded, it, well, it over-exceeded all of my expectations. I'm totally sold. 
Uh, can't wait to see more from this. Um, let me know what you guys thought in the comments down below. Thank you guys for watching. Of course, like, subscribe. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.